Hi, Dale here with Open Road Outfitters. In this video, I'm installing the Model 15225 hitch on a 2014 Harley Ultra. This hitch fits touring bikes starting with the 2014 model year that have a plain fender with no bumper. This triple plated chrome hitch comes with all the hardware you need plus a safety chain bracket, a tow bar, and a 1 and 7 8 inch ball. And this is one of the easier installs I've ever done. As for tools, you'll want T25 and T40 Torx bits, a couple of standard wrenches like 7 16 and a half inch. You'll need a 1 and 1 8 inch wrench or socket to mount the ball. Uh, be sure to have some blue thread lock on hand for the bolts. And the silicon caulk is optional. I'll show you a tip using that that'll make the install easier. So let's get started. First you just need to remove the saddlebags for this install. And when you've done that, remove the first two bolts in the fender strut on each side. There are a set of bushings that come with this hitch. The larger of the two bushings goes to the front hole. I like to dab these with a little silicon that helps hold them in place so I don't have to try to hold four bushings while I get the, the hitch up into position. Now it's a lot easier if you have a second person who can slide the hitch up into place and hold it. While they're doing that, put a little thread lock on the first bolt and when you get one of the holes lined up, front or back, it doesn't matter, insert the bolt and wrench it down a little bit just to hold it, but don't tighten it. You'll want to do the same for the other three bolts, the one on this side and the other two on the other side. Next, you're going to install a pair of small support brackets, one on each side down toward the bottom of the hitch. Now part of this connects to the inside exhaust bracket bolt, and the other part of it connects to the hitch. It just adds a little extra stability. Once you've done that on each side, tighten those bolts down and then tighten the bolts up at the top. The last thing you'll do is pin the tow bar into place and mount the ball. Be sure that you apply a liberal amount of thread lock on the threads and crank that thing down as tight as you can. So as you can see, this hitch blends nicely with the lines of the bike and even with the saddlebags off, it just isn't that obvious. So that's a wrap for this one, folks. Thanks for your time, and feel free to email us with any questions. Be sure to check out our website and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos about trailering and camping. Till next time, this is Dale with Open Road Outfitters, wishing you many happy journeys.